Hi, it's Fabio here from Functional Tennis and I'm just going to show you quickly how to put a timer in a video. Now I, ha I started with Adobe Premiere Pro and I figured I was googling the web to figure out a way to do it and I find it quite difficult. So, and I'm no film editor so I can imagine most people will struggle and I want to do as quick a job as possible. So I figured out an iMovie if I record a timer in an iPhone I could use that timer I could import it into my movie and sync it with the run for a fitness challenge because that's why I'm recording this video. It's for the functional tennis uh, speed challenge. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how it works now. So the first thing you need is iMovie. The second thing you need is an iPhone, which you can probably do it other ways, but this is the way I'm gonna show you. That's my first time doing it, showing you guys. So please bear with me here. Uh, so this is my iPhone here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the screen rec recording app. So this guy here, this guy is going to record everything that happens on the screen. Let me see, are we good? There, we're good to go. So the screen is now recording and I'm going to go to the timer. We go to the stopwatch and reset and I'm going to hit start here. Now I'm probably going to record for about 16, 17 seconds because I think most of the runs should be that quick to make our leaderboard. But hey, we'll go up to 20 just in case. So I'm going to stop this guy. I'm going to stop the record yes stop so that's successfully saved next I'm going to send it over to my laptop so this is it this is the guy here you can see him it will send him over to me on the MacBook so the guy has landed. Takes a while to zoom. It is there. So so that's it there. So that's stage one complete. Okay, so we're going to move on to the next stage here. I'm going to set this camera up here. So the next stage is setting up iMovie. So you go into iMovie, you create a new project. Now I'm going to get a video that I had, well, sorry, that I've taken from Noel Rubin. He's a top athlete. We reposted one of his videos in January and that's where I got the idea for this. So I'm going to show you how to do it now. So this is Noah's run here. He takes roughly just over 15 seconds. I'm going to get the screen recording that we took and drag it in on top here. Now, I'm going to go up to the settings, image settings here. It's this guy, or this, which guy is it now? Sorry, this guy here. And I'm going to do, is it a picture in picture? Do picture in picture. This might take a play, bit of playing around with, but let's get this guy here. We're gonna crop. We're gonna crop. That's what we're gonna do. First thing is we're gonna go to the the imported timer, and we are gonna crop to fit. So I'm gonna crop to fit. This already set up. Maybe. You need to make this guy bigger or smaller to suit you, but I'm just going to do it there. So that's it, ready to go. And we're going to do, if we, once you select picture and picture, then he goes there. We can make him smaller or bigger. Now the next thing is syncing it up. So. We need to find, so I'm going to cut this here. I'm going to do Command B, 
that's that guy we can remove the old one push this guy here so now it's just a matter of syncing up the two syncing up the Noel Rubin video and syncing up the timer so this takes a bit of playing around with maybe I'm, I'm actually not too far I may make this a bit wider here So that seems to be it. We play through it here. So now this is the intro. We know it didn't touch the, the yellow cone, so it makes it a bit harder. We we're going to give them a five twenty, and we just cut it here. go with 5.8 we'll, we'll go with 5.18 we'll be very generous here but uh yes yeah, so all, all i put in will be then a title we'll pick this guy here and do 15 15 so and then you can export them you can export the file over Ruben Charge. and there you go sorry I should have really been looking at you but uh, yeah I really hope this helped you and you yeah, feel free to get your videos up make sure you tag functional tennis speed challenge or if you found this video coincidentally for this specific reason great i'm hoping it'll help bye